Good evening. My name is Dr. Rhoda Wangondu and I'm here today in Dallas, Texas with the Strugglers Movement. I am a pharmacist here in the United States but with a great love for Kenya and first and foremost would like to condemn the violence that happened in Kisumu. We as Strugglers Movement in Diaspora are looking for civic engagement and support for our youth in order to enhance the capacity of Kenya to support the youth in leadership, in civic duties, and elections. So we would like going forward to be counted and in doing so we would like to have this movement support the best candidate for our youth to address issues that affect the youth. Lack of access to health care, mortality due to violence such as that in Kisumu. We condemn all of that and we seek to promote peace, change, and not only change but systematic change that can be sustainable to last through the decades so that Kenya can be a better place for all and so that the diaspora can have a voice in the leadership of Kenya. So part of the change you know we're advocating for here you know opening up opportunities such as uh, creating structures for financial investment. We would like to support our youth in Kenya we have the expertise, we have what it takes as uh, we look forward to the next uh, general elections. We're encouraging our young people to contest and vie for all positions in office, in the land, so that we can have uh, better youth representation. Uh, we trust that the future is youth. We are willing to put our resources, our support behind the youth leadership in our country so that we can have a futuristic leadership, a, a leadership with a future that is seeing beyond just five years of power. As, as the Kenyans in diaspora, we have experienced uh, difficulties, we have struggled in trying to get a few services or basic services to us while in Kenya and even while we're here. Basic services like a passport renewal, just having your ID card or birth certificate. We are, we are struggling. Everything we're doing, not, we don't have a seamless flow of service. So we need to have an improved service. And the only way to do this is to have fresh, new leadership. We are calling upon all our youth again to contest all available positions. We would like to take this opportunity to caution leaders in their campaigns that when you're going to a specific area to campaign, uh, be sure that uh, you have the right, the right spirit, the right attitude and respect the audiences. We do not know whether the violence in Kisumu was stage managed or it was authentic. So this is something that uh, we would like to condemn and uh, ask our young people not to be involved in violence at this time. We want to have peaceful campaigns, elections and results. And at the end of the day, we are looking to supporting leadership that is youth oriented, people who are associated with the struggles of our independence, struggle of our second liberation and so that we can have a true ultimate freedom economic and political as we look forward to the next elections the strugglers movement is a movement that we really want to make sure that we end up the struggle we know the people that have struggled for our country we know the people that have been there for us and we know the people that have the best interest of our country so we're asking all Kenyans both in their diaspora and in Kenya uh, uh, our country that we love so much I uh, would like you guys to focus on this election because it's a critical time that we all have to be real on choosing the right people in this forum. The people that are going to lead us in the, uh, uh, in the coming election, the people who are going to lead our country in the right direction, people who have interest in our country. As you see, all of us struggle to come to the U.S. We can't say that it was an easy ride for anybody. Uh, and uh, I know we all have uh, different uh, uh, ways that we came to America. But again, as you see, uh, the, struggle ha the struggle movement is all about telling the people of Kenya, telling the people of diaspora that, hey, it's time for us to end this struggle. So we'd like you all to support uh, the struggle movement and also in all areas and uh, in all aspects of uh, uh, our country to choose the correct and the right people that have the best interest of our country.